channel is Sweet Sweet Just See here with Candyland. And for my new subscribers, I'll explain more about Candyland in a minute. I'm about to wash my face and put on a a mask and listen to this and take notes. And I just thought I'd add y'all into the video and thank y'all for clicking the video. Okay. You don't pay bills. Jesus. It is like making a contract and not keeping it. God hates debt so much that he actually calls sin debt. Mm. Mm. He makes debt and sin synonyms. All of us have spiritual debt that we cannot pay. But the Bible tells us God has paid what? The debt. And he canceled the payment. I'm going to watch the numbers to see. This is vitamin really C. Scared. This or is also vitamin C. I check the numbers. I should see the same amount of people showing back up next Brightening. week to finish the top. Got this from Dollar Tree, and this was just a gift from my friend, from my best friend. So I got the dryer going. If I didn't say, that's what the noise is. And trying to edify my spirit, <laughs> learn something valuable, something that I could use and apply. And we're gonna put this face mask on. Okay, y'all, we're going to step on the stepper and fold some clothes and find something to watch on TV while I got my mask on. So I know it's ideal for some to have a relaxing mask and get in the bath or relax and read a book. For me, I got stuff to do, so let's do all of it together. And so I got my water here. I'm going to put a, a water pack in here. And so lately I've been using let me see, Skittles and I found out with well, this Skittles the tropical brand and I'll show y'all a picture here water mix and I found out just recently I like this one the blue pack is pineapple passion fruit and I like the pink one it's like a strawberry something but all of them are good enough but you know in every box there's uh, one or two that you like better Okay, and today is November 29th, 2023. Today is my 4,040 day straight of exercise. 4,040, so 40, 40. Okay, 40, 40. And it looks like it ought to taste like, like it ought to be like blueberry or something like that. But I'm not too big on blueberry and all of that. So I'm glad that it's pineapple. Why is it blue? I don't know, but I love it. Okay, Candyland, so I took the mask off and and fold clothes and all that. And so instead of putting anything else on top of the mask, because most of the time it'll tell you to like absorb it in. Mm, one second, y'all. My glasses match my... <laughs> it says, okay. <clears throat> Keep it on for 20 minutes. So I kept it on probably about 30 Remove mask and jelly pack remaining serum into skin. Wipe away any ex excess. And so, um, it just, I guess it just <laughs> got all the way in there, y'all. I don't know. So, I was about to put on some extra serum and stuff, but that may inter interfere with it. So, this is some serum. I was looking for some moisturizer because, can y'all believe I'm out of moisturizer? This is called anti-aging daily serum. So I was gonna put this on, but we'll just leave everything as is. So, okay, I said I was gonna say some, something about 
when I say Candyland. Okay, y'all, so Candyland, first of all, I'm sweets, so that's candy all by itself, right? Okay, but Candyland comes from my, my custom-made jewelry name, my custom-made name jewelry business, which is called iCandy, and I spell candy with a Q, and so I refer to um, my YouTube atmosphere uh, as Candyland. So I say, hey, Candyland, you know, so I'm talking to all of y'all, my subscribers, my new subscribers, my watchers. So it's Candyland because I'm sweets. So yeah, so if you want to know more about uh, iCandy jewelry, you can uh, check my eBay link below and see some stuff that I offer. And if you want something custom made, just reach out to me through my eBay message. And then we can go from there. Okay, now, um, let's see. Okay, so while I've, I've been, uh, now I know I've been multitasking. So, folding clothes, working out, wearing a mask, and also listening to something to edify my spirit. So, I was listening to um, Pastor Darius Daniels and his wife and another couple. I believe he may be a pastor too and wife. And so, they're having a open discussion. They're talking about soft era. And so, I'm going to just play it now. Well, in the next clip, and I'm going to be, um, well, it's like married couples, but for me, to me, uh, you can learn from anywhere. So, like, I can watch cartoons and learn something, you know what I'm saying? Or I can listen to kids talk and learn something. I can learn something from uh, men, women, older, younger, all kind of situations. So, I'm just open to receive, and I know God can use these platforms or these people, you know, to pour out to you. So, I'm just receptive and I feel like um, because I start my day with all of that, receiving and open myself up to what God has for me. And I'm always seeking him that he can uh, lead and direct me to the right things to listen to or watch. Um, you know, anyway, so I'm just blessed to be able to hear this. And I just thought while I'm getting ready or while I'm doing whatever, I, that we can just listen together. So uh, the part I'm going to start on is they're, they're talking about um, what they some things they want from their wives. Um, so I'm just going to click in right here at 23 or 24 minutes or something. And y'all can listen if you like and enjoy. And I'll be right here in the little circle listening, tuning in. As yeah. well. and, oh, right. and fellas and ladies, just so y'all know, she still don't want to tell y'all, but I'm going to tell you, it's not just no deep affection. It is. I'm talking that. I was giving co a code. No they know what I'm saying. Well, I had no, no idea what you're you talking about. You want to know? Like, like, you know Hand holding or something. Deep I affection. Six. <laughs> yeah, so the chat, we said intimacy. intimacy. So 30 days of intimacy and no raising my boys. 30 days straight. That's the goal. Right. 30 like days it. straight. That is a great Physical choice. intimacy? Physical oh, and soft tone. I didn't well, say that part. I yeah, said I don't that. Want that challenge. <laughs> I didn't say that part. I said that. This one has enough testosterone. Hey, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't want that. I don't want that. You, you okay on that part? <laughs> I mean, my. You're lucky. I, I got work to do. I can't. <laughs> I just want to see wow, the attempt. Right? Hey, man, I want to wow. see the attempt. I want to see their tip. This okay. will be on me. So wow. this is something, and we have a letter I'm going to read. It's similar to this, but I know for us as y'all's wives, can y'all tell Sheesh. us? Like if you were coaching. 30 days. Uh, it's the initiative, like taking this, sorry, to, to, so that I would initiate for at least 30 days. Doesn't always have to happen. Consecutively. Consecutively, Consecutively. I have to initiate. Wow. That. Yes. Because I'm not the initiator. You I didn't say that part. I let just said I'm going to work on my aggression. <laughs> <laughs> like, for the record, I'm going to work on the being gonna, a little more soft. Do better. So, I'm used to being chased, so I don't know how to no, do it. No, but at the same wow. time, but we as men, we like wow. to feel wanted at the same. We don't never want to feel like every time it's something we want intimacy, it always has to be us initiating. Right, so that's why it's part of my challenge because I recognize that and I'm trying to do better at that because it's yeah, we, my you, weak point. You're, you're amazing at that now. We, 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 we talked about that. Well, you can do better, baby. Well, hold on now. Hold on. <laughs> Uh, I'll probably do the most of this shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was, I'm feeling like we're in reverse over it's here. A, and now I'll be like, can we just like, huh? cuddle? Like, 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 That's what I feel. <laughs> we just cuddle. Oh, I'm sorry. We just like, <laughs> like it's 5 30, Rod. I have to sneak in the room and be like, are you sleep? I have to, sneak in the, I have to check in on this one because she will count out. She will clock out on me. Uh, I think we just I really think I'm trying to. I'm getting old. I'm getting old. <laughs> <laughs> she'll look at she'll be like, so, 
not getting none tonight, huh? <laughs> and then when you want to hold me yeah. and that's all you want to do, I'll be like... <laughs> That's how Rod be too. What is this? Just hold me. Just hold me, okay. Sure. But I do think that, you know, and we See, talk about that this. that soft light. We like that soft light. Just hold me sometimes. I think we talked about this at the couples thing. We want to really make sure that we're striving to be the better versions of ourselves as wives. And so, so those are some of the things. And this soft light thing, you mentioned it to me over the summer. So it's like been on my heart. But I still am trying to learn how to be that. So I'm hearing what you're saying. So... Let's put your coaching hat on, like Coach Darius' mm -hmm. hat on. If you were coaching a couple, first us and then them, um, how would you teach me, to, or what would you tell me to do to embrace this soft life? So it's not me becoming another person, but it's me embracing. What would you teach me? Or what would you tell me I need to do? All right, so the, we, this is, we keep it at keep it 100, right? Keep it real. Yeah. So, so I'm coaching you one-on-one, -on -one or I'm coaching us? You're coaching us. us. Yes. Uh -huh. So if I was coaching us, yes. I wouldn't coach you. I would coach me. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And what would you tell yourself? And I would coach me into one realistic expectation about what you're probably going to get. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and it ain't going to be 30 days. You ain't going to get no soft. No, let me, tell you, let me tell you why. Because that... It's not lowering, it's not lowering okay. expectations, okay. right? And I feel like when, when people say, like, realistic, they feel like you're lowering the expectations or you don't have faith okay. or et cetera. You know what I mean? Right. But a person, a person can change, a person can tweak, mm -hmm. like, behaviors. Okay. They can have a change in perspective. Mm -hmm. You can't change wiring. Right. right. So by the time an adult has gotten into your life like marriage yeah that wiring like that wiring and that programming mm -hmm. so part of his personality and god given right. then the other is like is like all the other influences mm. that shape that person before you got there wow that's good and so the likelihood of that changing mm -hmm. it's just very unlikely mm. so i would coach myself into i would coach me mm -hmm. into clarity about this is the essence of that person's wiring okay right right so um, that would give me realistic expectations. Okay. So I'm not putting pressure on you mm, okay. to do something that's already going to be a little foreign to you. Uh -huh. So if you love me, you got pressure on yourself. Right. So I would coach me into realistic expectations okay. and then management strategies on how to manage if I'm not getting what I want in a healthy way. Wow. Well, that's and so that's, that's when people start doing crazy yeah, stuff. It's like, yo, you're not getting what you want. Yeah. Now you're acting out. Right. Because you don't have a healthy way to, it's like, oh, she talking to me crazy. Let me go talk to somebody else. Oh, yeah, yeah. As opposed to, no, let me coach you into a healthy way to manage. Right. Right. Exactly. Right. Yeah. Then I would coach you, if I were coaching you, I would coach you into clarity about how me not getting what I'm getting affects me. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's, That's good. So if I can it see how it affects you, yeah. then this, it makes this, me want to change. This, it that's what creates good. empathy. Yeah, yeah that's okay. good. It creates okay. the empathy that you need yeah. to keep changing. Because it's one thing to try to change because you're trying to please me. Yeah. Right. It's another thing to try to change when you realize this right. is how this affects him. Wow, that's good. And, yeah. if, you, and if you love somebody, mm -hmm. then that empathy right. will, will help. So I'll try to coach you into empathy mm -hmm. and then coach you into, hey, now let's get real practical because this is not going to be instinctive for you for a while. Okay. Yeah. Right. So it's going to have to be intentional for a while. And it may even feel mechanical for a while. Okay. What are some of the things that you can do behavior-wise right. to build up that muscle yeah. to the point where it becomes instinctive? And so that's what I would want to know. Because in our, in our letter that came in, the first thing the person asked is they didn't even know where to start. So I think just um, even listening to what the effects it has on another person, that's really good. But so for me as a woman, what does that mean to coach me in that area so you you said that it's like behaviors that i have to have so is it me thinking more before i speak or is it what is it yeah so me? yep so i would so once i got clear on what relational because it's not we're talking about soft life in the context of relationship right it's really about needs okay. it's not about right. that's good. okay soft, that makes sense it is sense. like hey what is it that I need in this relationship and yeah. what is it that I'm not getting when you behave this way? Okay. You know what I'm saying? Right. So it would be um, once I got clear on what those needs are. So let's say I needed verbal affirmation. Mm -hmm. Right. So let's say that's one of the things. And let's say I needed initiation of okay. physical 
intimacy. Now you're coaching us. Right. Yeah. <laughs> now we're on y'all. Right. Then I would say, hey, um, and I wouldn't coach you on this in front of me. Okay. Right. You would coach. So you would coach Chi Chi off by herself. 100%. Yep. Right. So um, because I wouldn't need to, it's not going to feel the same to me if I know it's planned. Oh. Mm. It needs to be a little spontaneous. So y'all but want it's it spontaneous. Be planned. It's going to be planned, yeah. but I don't need to hear the plan. Gotcha. It wouldn't help me if I right. heard the plan. Okay. That makes sense. So, yeah, I would coach and say, hey, all right, so he needs to hear, mm -hmm. okay, what are the things about him? Right. Because it's got to be real. Yeah. You got me? So what are the things about him yeah. that you do uniquely appreciate? Like, right. give me two or three of those things. Yeah. And then if you would tell me that, okay, well, I like the way he looks or I like whatever, mm -hmm. then I would say, okay, let's make it an attempt. Every time you think about those things, mm -hmm. say it. You see it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing. Every okay. time you think about those things, say it. Okay. Every time, say it. Now, mm -hmm. there are going to be times you're not going to say it. Mm -hmm. But if, if, if I'm telling you to say it, every time you think about it, you're going to say it more. Mm -hmm. Right. That, that's what we're getting at, right? Yeah. Okay. So if I say it more about how grateful I am, then you'll believe it a little more. Yeah. If it's, yeah. If it's gen you know what I mean? It's got to be a genuine thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's got to be a genuine thing. And then I'll be like, yo, okay, let's talk about initiating intimacy. Right. And let's say, I'm going to say, what days uh, are there days of the week that you know? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, don't, don't, this is on TV every day. But you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, are there days of the week that you know realistically initiating is just not in you? Yeah. And you need to know that. So if let's say like Tuesdays are super long days for us. Yep. So let's just say Tuesday is a day where you know, you know, mm -hmm. I'd be like, hey, what days besides Tuesday where you feel like right. that energy's up? Because if you, I'm trying to be uh, <laughs> yeah. clear here. Yeah. Because he don't want it lazy. <laughs> right. Don't, you know what I mean? He don't, he don't want, want it lazy. lazy. He wants he you all into he it. Want you, he wants you lock okay. in all the way there, not... You, you want it? No. It ain't like passing out some no. school snacks. <laughs> yeah, be yeah. like, yes. Yeah, so yeah. what days can you be like fully present and do that? Yeah. And and you be like, you might be like, I could do it Wednesdays and Fridays or Wednesdays, Thursday and Friday or whatever. Then I'll say those are the days that, that you do it. Because it's going to be behaviors because the wiring is the wiring. That's really good. And then it also allows us to cultivate the environment for you to succeed. Right. So even if we want that, we still got to create an environment to where you do like us, but we're doing something extra. Yes. Yes. And, and that list things, we were talking about. And that yeah. will play a big role in, okay, I can do this because he's a, he's showing me the effort. Right. And it's allowing me to be who I am and also take a step into that place where it's not necessarily a safe place that I'm used to going to do. Right. But now it feels like, okay, I can step outside of myself. Yeah, the desire is different. different. That's good. Because yeah, our biggest thing is, and I'm, or was, was, if I don't like you, I don't want to hug you or touch you. But he's like, I can do it too while I'm at. I'm like, well, I cannot. Yeah. A connection for gotcha, me. Gotcha. I got all these muscles. They don't do anything for me <laughs> when I'm upset. You know? That's Rod. Rod's initiation is keep the blanket off of him when he's laying in bed. <laughs> and she's going to walk right past these little eyes every time. Oh, oh, man. It ain't it. You're that not going home? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that, that's, that's good. I, I, I like to set the days. Can we do set the days? You still ready for the thirty days? Okay. It's no, I'm gonna try thirty. I want to see. How <laughs> you brought it up. I want to hold you today. I want to see. Thirty how days. I want to help you keep your you word. Keep Other people are gonna join yeah. us in this challenge. Yes. yes. But that's something you know, and we laugh about this. But I know for me, I definitely want to embrace that selfer side of me. Mm -hmm. I know there there's a side because you said it when, with the kids. Um, just when you all see in the home life, you see that softer, more empathetic, fun Shamika. And so I want to bring that. I don't want to yeah. always be that aggressive, like, work, 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 100%. Shamika. I want to bring that other side. So that's something I, that I'm committed to continue to work. Can I ask y'all something? Yeah. Oh, I feel like I'm being, like, a coach now. It's okay. But Go I, ahead. Not, it's not a coaching coach. I'm, I'm really curious. Yes. So if I were to say when y'all are, like, boss mode, yeah. do you have peace? Yeah, I like telling people what to do. Yeah. <laughs> I like, I like being in control. Tell what to do. So is that that that's peaceful for me? I have a little bit of a control issue. Even that's why I don't bring a whole lot of people on to work for me or do things yeah. because if you're gonna do it wrong, I'd just rather do it myself. But you have so, you're at peace internally when you yeah. are because we're in control. Right? Yeah, I'm not upset at all. Exactly. So yeah. that's when you really your authentic self. Yeah. Wow. When you're at peace. Yeah. 
But I'm at peace when I'm at home hanging out with y'all and laughing with the boys and stuff like that. I'm not necessarily in control then. Right. right. But, but it kind of go back to the point I was making about wiring. Yeah. yeah. And, like, I don't feel like we want y'all to feel the pressure to be... Because I don't want you to make me feel like right. I have to be another person to meet your needs. 100%. Yes. Yes. Freedom you know I mean? is important. Yeah, yeah. 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 like Freedom. I am, I am a measured, um, there, there are a number of things that I am. Right. And I don't want to feel like I got to become a totally different person for you to be over the top in love with me. Right. Um, so I don't want you to feel that way, that I'm asking you to be a completely different Person. Yeah. Right, but I also I don't want to be treated like every other person in your 100%. life either. So that that's just where I I'm at that. with it. Yeah. yeah, that's what I need. I think so I'm I think clear. Y'all, yeah, so I think we clear. We agree. That's the soft life. I do not want to feel like I am treated like everybody else. Yeah, no, I'm telling you that the only mistake. That was actually me telling you. Can I, can I ask y'all another question? Uh -huh. All right. I just took over your interview. That's right. right. That's okay. got, in the other episode, y'all you, you talked about, y'all asked Crystal, and y'all uh. talked about, like, uh, I don't feel like me and Rod getting that energy. Okay. Because there was some energy I felt like y'all had on that they, episode they where it's like, really? they want us to be soft, but we need to know, they need to know that this is what make me feel, so I need the gas. And, come on, Tia. Oh, oh, yeah, come oh, on. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, Because at the end of the day, I, and I say this to you off camera, all the things, you saw his face expression? Did you see the face expression? Okay, you saw his face expression? You saw his face expression? You saw his face expression? That right there ought to matter. I got to armor up. But this is why y'all need to get with men who have daddies. And you need to have a dad in your life. I got a daddy. You have a daddy. Wow, you just insulted my dad. together and I think we both just kind of operated and moved and moved you know what I'm saying so courting and doing things ain't been your thing I remember a time where it was like open the door for me it's 2000 and so on so why I gotta open the door for you See, no I said the, the click on the I'm not your church church girl I said it opens the door no 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 walk around so back in the day they started because and you know what back in the day they put the key in the door to unlock the door that's why they opened the that's an excuse. We hit the button. Well, I'm talking about. Opens just I'm like the type of girl. I'll open the door for you. Listen, <laughs> but that's what I'm saying. That that's the earlier on, not me not knowing Ooh. no better or being a woman and stuff. I realized that you know this is ghetto the way that I'm living, <laughs> and I deserve more. And you need to do better. So if you want me to be soft, I need to not do masculine stuff. You don't have to, but like, the gas is a reach. That's expectation. Expect putting gas in my car is a reach. That's a bare minimum. What I'm saying is, you and you still me. haven't washed it. <laughs> I've been asking you. I've been asking you, and you're like, just tell me. I'm like, you still ain't like that. Wired a certain way. Uh huh. Ask me. Yeah. Give me the playbook. I can execute. I've been asking. But if I'm not driving your car, right? Hold on, I'm not driving your. You're car, not usually. I don't know when your gas tank is low. Right. But you want me just randomly to be like, or pick a day a week that you just go just to the gas station. Yeah, I want you to think about it. We've talked think about, about this. I want you to think about my gas. I want you to think. See, that's one, baby. Let's go back to it. Let's wind it back. You See, know what I'm when we have a do you want soft life? I, I do you want to be happy? But I think it needs to be. So <laughs> you want to be happy? Yeah. He told me. He said, "I just want to be happy." Just, happy. We went on date night with y'all, right? Not too long ago. Yeah. We we got to the restaurant before you guys. I'm sitting in the car. Rod's like, "Are we gonna wait for them? Because I gotta go to the bathroom. So let's go inside." I said, "Okay." So I'm sitting in the car, I'm and he gets out door. the car. And he's standing at his door, like, "What are you doing?" I said, "I'm waiting for you to walk around <laughs> and, and open, open the door, door for me." Like I have to teach him at you this point. You didn't have point. to teach me, baby. I was wait, 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 wait. You didn't know what about Wait, 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 wait. I just have a question. Okay. Okay. It's just a clarified question. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, even when you are in the car, uh -huh. <laughs> yes, inside, uh -huh. yep, you want him to get out. Walk around and open. Hundred percent. His okay. car is three now, feet I high. I open when you're getting in the car. Mm -hmm. 
But I let you get out by oh, yourself. Yeah. That's most time ballet open the door for you, so I just get out. <laughs> no, I'm just saying in general. Oh, okay. Like, if we're not going to a restaurant. I just like my door to be open, because it's a form of, like, um, it's a gesture. It's so a you want to say Did your dad teach you that? Yeah. See? I didn't yeah. have the a dad. That man should always open the door for you. That's why I was like, even when we walk. See, Derek, look at Derek. Look at Derek's face. My energy, y'all. Because I can't say it. I cannot say it. I just never complain about it. What I want to say right now. Babe. I never complain about it. But have you noticed, like, when we go... I'm going to say, when the episode's over, <laughs> listen, I'm going to let y'all know. No, what I didn't know what you're going to say. You're not going to say it. But listen, do you ever so notice when we go that. places, I step to the side, um, and then I let you open it no, up? No, that's right. That is no, that's completely fine. Oh, okay. That. Okay. That's completely... I just... Okay. I never knew, because I open the doors when we're going in there. Any yeah. establishment? Yeah. Uh, your car door when you're getting in? Yeah. But I'm just... I'm trying to be clear. <laughs> We pull up to a, a place. Do I do a it, okay. we, I put the vehicle in park. <laughs> I need to get out and you stay in. <laughs> Sit there. I walk all the way around yeah. and open up the door so you can get out. Yep. That's what And you want. you're supposed to start the car like, you know how sometimes y'all will open the door and put us in and then take your time. <laughs> you're supposed to start the car and have the um, car running so we can have some air too. <laughs> but I don't get into all those details. I'm just grateful for but what I got. Here. But since we're here, <laughs> I'm grateful. <laughs> I'm grateful for what I got. I like to make sure. All I need to okay. be soft, all I need is for you to just be affectionate to me. If I, you can show me affection, I can, I can. See, I think y'all are in our I think we need to do another episode, Rob. <laughs> and it needs to be called, it needs to be called, It's Not Fair. It is not fair. And this it may not like be. This seems like a lot. That is a this, lot. Look, I'm going to tell you. I was saying, y'all shoulders are broad. I'm going to say, she said, that's masculine energy to pump gas. Hey, I, I want y'all to listen to me. I want but you, if y'all know. Hold on, look, look, look. All me and Rod is asking for is can y'all not uh -huh. go gangster on us? Can it no, not no, be gang related? No, Rod is asking for sexual no, 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 intimacy spuriation. No, 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 I'm not going to be gang related. We're still giving y'all some... some what? These, these, are, these are way easier than what y'all asking. What yeah, we're just like, what? hey, can can you not like me? It's... it's it's not a problem. Yes. I'm just saying. It's not I'm looking at y'all like it's, it's like one thing problem. on our list, and then I'm looking up at y'all list. And, and then no, but I, her because I, I said that's not stuff. I, what is the one thing I asked for is just if I could have affection. But no, you just I just heard your heart. She did. You, you know, just I just heard what was in I your really, heart. I really I'm, I'm not making it an issue. But I really, <laughs> but I really want that. you. Yes. No, I just think mind. that's I just think that's what men should do. Open the door. So that's what I'm saying. I ain't never tripped about it. Wow. That's what should happen. Wow. Just so, because we gotta close this out. But this is one of the things the gas station. What happens to these home cooked meals and during the week? Yeah, like it's, it's almost like okay. Hold on. Hold on. You and you tell me, don't make my meal prep no more. You forgot cinnamon, all over my cinnamon, uh, my <laughs> no, potatoes. When I come home, I mean, we don't get this. You don't go. We don't. We go see, home together. Because I'm gonna tell you what home. it feels like. It feels like <laughs> women want the traditional man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But don't want to be a the traditional woman. woman. And I don't have a problem with it, baby. I'll serve you all day long. I, oh, I'm not talking about the I'll serve. cook for you. I'll watch you. your energy. Yeah. I'll do it all. We need that. I'm talking about grandma <laughs> energy. <laughs> grandma energy. But no, so... Everybody want to go to grandma's house. And grandma cooking. And my baby family, got home cooked breakfast. that wasn't the same. That's your household. No, no, but I'm just saying, but that's what I'm used yeah, to. Yeah, grandma's that's what I'm saying. But I want y'all to live here. But wait. But I think what we're saying, we, we just, we're looking for that, like, affection and that energy. Because for the record... When um, I had to get gas last week, and I called her, and I was like, I cannot understand. Because literally, I walk up wow, to Wow, the gas comes up to No, listen, let me tell y'all why. Because I am when not able to be in my soft mode anymore. I'm at the gas pump. People walking up to me, guys trying to holler. I'm it's like, crazy. do I need to go get my pepper spray? I need, I'm trying to tell them, no, leave me alone. So it's like, I done had to get into a whole nother mode in person. For the gas. For gas. So I was like, so I called her and said, I can kind of see how that takes you out of your soft life because you got to be a thug at the gas station these days when you're a pretty woman because guys are going to do that so i'm like i'm trying to worry about do i need my pepper spray right now i have no so, problem with the gas you just right. haven't done it baby, my gas right. is low how <laughs> often do you have to pump gas <laughs> i don't want i don't want to talk about it because it's going to make us come all the way that i don't want us to come off i don't want to come off elitist or anything but it's like when was the last time you pumped gas yeah, yeah. Well, last week. <laughs> but I don't have to pump it often because I do have a schedule where I make sure that somebody... It's taken care of. Yeah, that it's taken right. care of. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I hope y'all enjoyed that. I was in the background doing this and that, but I enjoyed that. And at the ending, well, I cut it off, but y'all know I'm going to link it below uh, so you can watch the whole one or maybe even watch uh, other videos from, from Shamika 
and Darius. So uh, it was quite interesting. Y'all let me know in the comments. Did y'all stay and listen or did y'all, did anything benefit y'all? You know, have it encouraged y'all or anything in y'all's relationships or marriage? And so like I was saying, you can learn something. Although I'm not married, never been married. Um, I think some of the some of the things that they talk about can help you in business, your work relationships, your friendships, you know, as well as your um, your dating relationships or, uh, you know, family and kids and everything. Sometimes you can take something else that they're talking about and then use it, apply it to other areas of your life. So I'll just say for me, not y'all, for me, I can hear something and be like, well, I, I should do that in this situation. You know, so that's how I do Um I'm always looking for, I'm always uh, looking to learn something that can help me just in life, honey, cause ooh, life <laughs> just help, need help. So I'm so blessed to uh, find uh, uh, Christian people that are showing us how to do it, showing us by example, as well as uh, mentoring us in a way, you know, some things that can help us. At least we can see how they do or what they say. Or, and try to implement and see, you know, if that works in our life. Or, you know, maybe not everything works, but if you just get one thing, then great. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments um, what you think or if you even were able to receive anything. So I appreciate you for watching and staying with me today. And oh, one more thought. Okay, this is my team with earrings. Remember I said I know I have things in the closet. I can make it match. And so, um, yes, yeah, so I put it on with this two-piece today. And, it, you know, it's matching the whatever this is it kind of matches the whole thing anyway i love them so it's my first time wearing them and i'm not really going anywhere but you know how you uh i'm dressed up for work and this is what i call work so i'm an intern here on youtube so i got dressed for this and yes juicy y'all see it uh let's see what else i said i was gonna fix my lash today and i haven't yet we're gonna get to it um Oh, the uh, mask I put on and the serum that, um, you know, it says don't wash it off. But like when I got ready to put a little makeup on, uh, a little of the my MAC Studio Fix, it um, it don't it doesn't do well. So I always know I like to have moisturizer on my face. But well, whatever that is, it you know, it, it just makes it look dry. So um, I just prefer having moisturizer uh, up under up, uh, up under my makeup. All the time, even if I'm not, um, if I haven't done a mask, just my regular uh, cleanse face always ends in a mask with some type of SPF in it and uh, anti-aging properties or something. So that's the end of the video. I didn't have, I didn't even know what the video was going to be about today. I know how I come on, don't know. I just start videoing. So that's not really the way they would suggest. You have, you have an idea, you get it together, execute it. Go ahead and have the title and the thumbnail ready and then make the video. So I've heard people say it like that, but mine kind of don't go like that. Not so much right now. So thank y'all for watching and y'all know I can get the going on and on. I appreciate you and thank you again. Welcome new subscribers. Welcome anybody that's in the background uh, just viewing the video. I would love to have you here in Candyland and y'all check out. It's the holidays. It ain't nothing like a custom made name piece so check out some of my things in my ebay store the ebay link is below just click it it'll take you straight there you can see a few pieces you know or if you want something custom made it's probably too late to get that made now at this point it's, it's going to be too late to get that made for christmas but you know just in case you still want to get it and it'll be an after christmas present okay or birthday or for valentine's day you know you can just have it have it in advance okay and soon you know texas rangers won the world series so i will have some texas rangers jewelry custom made name inspired by texas rangers jewelry that will be in the store within the next week or two these videos i was uh, i asked people to new subscribers if they would uh give me their name if they if they want to be shouted out to so just give me their name in the um in the description, I mean, not the description, in the comment box, I will shout them out. So I have a, uh, one lovely lady over from my mom's channel, from Miss Lena's Kitchen. Her name is, uh, uh, her YouTube handle is Ghetto to Country Girl, but her name is Marjorie. So what's up, Marjorie? And thank you for coming over to uh, Sweet Juices Athleisure Life and joining Candyland. Thank you so much. I'm so glad to have you here, okay? 
and I'll shout you guys out uh, as well. So thank you all for subscribing. And yes, you need to be a subscriber in order to get shouted out. It's like a thank you for subscribing, right? So thank you all for who, who subscribes. If you want me to shout you out, no problem. I'd love to do that. Okay, just as a thank you, I appreciate you for coming over here and subscribing and hanging and learning and having fun with me. Learning if there's something to learn, first of all. And having fun with me, exercise with me, and just whatever we're doing over shopping, going to church, all that good stuff here in Candyland. Okay, well, I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you so much.